Hello everyone and welcome back to Freedom Through Confidence. My name is Ben and in this video today I want to talk to you about how to transform yourself into a new person. Now of course I'm not talking about this in the literal sense, you know Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Ironhide and all that. This is more in the psychological sense, how through self-improvement you can transform your life and your state of being. And so as always, the plan is to take a super complicated topic and break it down into a few points so that you can take it away and start practicing it on your own. So let's just jump straight into what you can do to start transforming yourself into a new person. So as tends to be the case with self-improvement, transforming yourself and transforming your life begins with a choice. It begins with a choice to become what could be described as a better version of yourself or a different version of yourself. It just depends on what your perspective is. It is when you decide what kind of a person you want to be. And let me be clear, this is not a fixed destination. This is something that you're probably gonna shift and change a lot. That's one of the popular self-help misconceptions is that, you know, there's one big life transformation that you go through, but that's not really the case. There are multiple small ones that you will go through over the course of your life every single year, every single month maybe, where you kind of update your goalpost on what kind of a person you want to become and revise some parts and edit some things away and clip away the stuff that you don't want to work towards anymore. But it always starts with making a choice to be different from who you are right now. And then the next thing is that you start to take action. So it's not enough to just make the decision on what kind of person that you want to be. You also have to start taking regular and consistent action in working towards becoming that person as well. So whether that action is learning how to take care of yourself more, or it is applying for that job that you want to aim towards, or going back to school, or starting back with fitness, or going on a date with someone, it all requires you to take action. And more importantly, I'm talking about consistent daily action. I'm not talking about you just going all in for just a little bit of time of massive action as if that's going to solve anything. No, it's just going to burn you out. What I always recommend instead is that you just take small consistent steps. Just if you don't have the motivation and the drive on a certain day to take the bigger action because of course there is a time for massive action it's when you're super super motivated but for everything else i just want you to take the minimum amount of steps that you need to take just keep yourself moving forward keep the momentum up that's all you need to do there's no need for taking stupid amounts of action every single day. No, just on a day where you don't have the motivation and they don't have the drive to do stuff, which is gonna be most days, if we're perfectly honest with each other, most days you aren't gonna feel like doing what you need to do. So on those days, just take the minimum amount of action towards the kind of person that you want to be. And then of course, the next thing is the bit that sucks. And that is, well, you have to face failures, setbacks, and disappointments. And I'll be honest, guys, you're gonna have to face a lot of them because when you make a decision to transform your life or to transform yourself into a new person, something that you're gonna do several times throughout the course of your life, at first you're gonna suck at it. I'm like, that's just the reality. We all suck at things the first time we do them. Uh, well, no, not always. Most of the time we suck at stuff when we try it for the first time. And that includes transforming your life and working towards becoming a new person. You're going to suck at it. And that means you're going to make mistakes. You're going to fail. You're going to have setbacks. There's going to be disappointments. And you have got to learn how to deal with that. The only way to achieve the goals that you want to achieve in life is to fail at them a hundred, a thousand, ten thousand times 
and from each one of those failures you learn a little bit more you learn a little bit better how to do something anything that you have ever learned in your life that you are good at now you got good at it through repetition my little brother for example is an absolute beast on video games like call of duty uh, it doesn't matter what the game is, I can hand him a Call of Duty game and a controller and he will be better than 90-95% of players he plays every single time. Why is he so good at that game and other kind of similarly styled games? It's because he used to spend hours a day playing these games every single day and repetition made him very, very good at these games. Like competitive level when he was a little bit younger but as it happens he also had to fail a lot there's a lot of games that he lost there was a lot of times when he had a negative you know kill to death ratio there was a lot of times when he just sucked and he had bad days and he had to learn how to get over that and to become better over time and you have got to do the exact same thing so that is the complex idea broken down into three very very straightforward principles principle number one you decide what kind of a person that you want to be step number two is that you start to take the action on a daily consistent basis at the very least just the minimum amount of action that you need to take towards becoming that person and then number three you fail a lot and you get setbacks and you are disappointed and you make mistakes and then you learn from those and you become better because repetition is what will create that new reality for you so i hope you have found this video useful let me know your thoughts and questions in the comment section down below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well i put out a video every single day at this point so if this is what you're interested in make sure to subscribe to the channel leave a like on the video but for now this video is over and i look forward to seeing you in future videos here on this channel very soon